How do you calculate the numbers for a rental property? Real estate investments can be a great way to earn passive income, but you need to be careful. Not all rentals are the same, so you need to be able to identify which ones make sense financially. That can change based on various factors, but the main way to determine if an investment will be a good one is to run the numbers. The first thing you do is figure out how much rental income, operating expenses, and mortgage payments would be. The trickier part of this is determining your expenses. Of course, it's always possible for unexpected things to pop up, but here's a list of some of the most common expenses. Accounting for vacancy, the fees of the property managed company if you want one, leasing fees, repairs, insurance, taxes, utilities, etc. Just a few, just to name a few. This is where the math comes in. I recommend you calculate what your net operating income and cash flow would be. For the first equation, simply subtract your expenses from your rental income, and that's your net income. Then take that number and deduct your mortgage payment and that leaves your cash flow. If those two don't end in a positive number, run away. The property is not the right investment. This topic entails a lot of subjective and confusing things. So I recommend getting advice from an expert and I would love to help you. I'm Ruby Miranda, the Texas Queen of Real Estate.